this small illumination grows and grows and grows and then we come to a place where you study and you're you're included in a group and that's all by bestowal from above the creator is organizing us but still he he's expecting for us to to take a few steps so we can show that we are inclined toward him that this is why all kinds of disturbances appear these are not disturbances these are revelations as to the fact that we are opposite we're distant we're not like the creator and what we should do is to immediately bring the later reforms on them that whatever is revealed whatever is not revealed no matter what there's one remedy for all connect more in the ten and bring the later reforms this is the cure for all our illness for all our problems and if we instinctively we can reach a state that whatever problem comes we connect more another problem we connect more more light that reforms then we advance in the road of Ahishina. I will hasten it if we, what we're looking for is a different kind of cure for our different states will advance in the path of Beito in due time being distant taking more time more pain more confusions that's the way it's going to be Do we feel that every day we're advancing more and more so that we immediately turn to the light of reforms? That's a question for a workshop. Do we feel that we're advancing every day with speed, with better efficiency to call for the lighter reforms. Or maybe we don't really feel it, and then what should we do? We may stay in one place for a hundred years, and it seems to us that we're advancing. Because advancement is only by the lighter reforms. And if you're not asking for it, there's a verse, and uh, they died without any wisdom. Go ahead. What are the, the signs of advancement? Did we advance yesterday more than the day before that, or not? 